Are you positive? Say power. Power. One more time, say power. Power. My Sunday school class is awesome. My Sunday school class is awesome. This young man right here has got power. Everybody say power. Everybody say Holy Ghost. Power. And if you have the Holy Ghost, that power is inside of you. Please go ahead and be seated. Amen. Brother Nate, you got to stick with me, right? Amen. Now, I move around a lot, right? Is that okay? Power? Power. Power? Power. Amen. Brother Josh, if you bring that up for me in just a minute, Brother Blankenship, Brother Bembry, this is indeed a great honor. I do not take this lightly. Amen. We have an awesome church. And while we're on that, just a quick fix, we are very spoiled. And I know some of you won't admit that, how spoiled we actually are. How about if I prove it to you? Amen. We take the word of God, this congregation sometimes, for granted. Is that true? I said, is that true? Yes. Never again. Everybody say, never, 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 never. ever never. again. I'm talking to you today about my Sunday school class and about power. I have these elders over here praying for me a lot. Today, this young man laid hands on me. Yes. Amen. Yes. Right here. Thank you, Nate. Let's, stand. Let's give him a hand. Amen. <laughs> Let's go real quick to Acts 3 and 6. And Peter said, look right here with me. Everybody say, silver, silver. and gold. And gold. Have, I none. have I none. But such as I have, <laughs> such as I have, Give I thee. Everybody say, what you got? Everybody say, what do you have? Inside this building, we got all kinds of power, right? Amen. You can feel the anointing of God moving all over this place, right? And if you're our guests and our visitors, I want to thank you for coming tonight. Because that same power that I'm talking about, you can have it right now amen biggest problem we have here we need to start sharing more that power everybody say that power everybody say one more time power what we have to do is we need to look at that jesus christ our king our god that's the same yesterday today and forever right huh right are you sure so what he does right here in this altar, he can do it your job. Amen? Can he do that at the store? I got a testimony. I was belly aching to God one time. I said, God, I've been testifying, and I don't see any fruit. I don't see any fruit, God. I pulled into the gas station, and this guy come walking up to me, tears coming down his face, Brother Angeli. God filled that man at the gas station with the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. At the gas station, you know what I said? Everybody say, in Jesus' name. I said, such as I have in Jesus' name. Everybody say, in Jesus' name. When you've been down in the blood, you've been baptized in Jesus' name, that blood starts covering you and that power starts coming on. Everybody say, power. I want more power. And the only way I can get more power is i got to get closer to my God. Amen? That means some things in me has got to come out. Amen? I've got to decrease and he has to. The biggest problem we have right now, the biggest problem we have is we're a bunch of spoiled people.
people. We've been walking around Jericho too much. We've been running our mouth too much. Not used to this, are you? If you know me for very long at all, ask Brother Bruckemeyer back there. He'll tell you all about me. Ask Brother Bill right behind me. He'll tell you all about me. Ask Brother Bembry. <laughs> Amen. He's counseled me more than a couple times. <laughs> but the real deal is, I'm jealous. I work with a jealous God. My God is jealous. He's jealous. What is he jealous of? His people. He said, where's your faith? You going through a storm? I know you are. Whether it's physical, financial, won't you allow Jesus to come up to the bow of your boat? Let him say, peace, be still. Everybody say, peace, peace. be still. Peace. I'm going to show you somebody who just did that. Sister Cook, would you stand up, sweetheart? Right. You know I've been talking about her for a while. Amen. There's people in my shipyard who know that lady. There's people in my shipyard who know each and every single one of you. So when they come here, I don't want them to see strangers. I want you to be able to go up there and say, hey, I'm the one he's talking about. Amen. I'm the one right here. Everybody say, I am. And you are. Get your eyes off your own prize and start getting in on Jesus. Amen. And one more thing I want to ask you today. Say one more thing. It's going to be hard. It's going to be difficult. And I know we're jumping. We're all throwing down. We're having a good time and gone. And then I come up here. Oh, boy. I've studied this for over a month. I've asked God to put it on my heart. I want God's anointing to follow me every day of my life. In the airport, gas station, grocery store. Ask my wife. We have to have a lady coming in here before too long. We was at Walmart checking out. Checking out. And she was from Barbados. Her name is Ruth. She's going to come here and she's going to get the Holy Ghost. How do I know that? Because we invited her. She knows Tim Smith right there. She knows Janelle Bembry right there. Amen. She knows a lot of you right now. The thing is, is do you know him? Do you really know him? Would you like to meet him? Would you really? I want to look at you and say, happy Valentine's Day. But the best Valentine's Day you'll ever have is when you're the one praying someone through the Holy Ghost at a gas station. Amen. Amen. At a gas station. At the pump. Outside. Not inside. Every single one of you are so quiet. I know I'm not used to this. Ask Brother Weaver. He'll tell you about me too, man. But here's the greatest thing. The greatest legacy that we can have. You see this man right here? What an anointing that's on his life. That video back there, Eli, Josh, y'all's doing an awesome job. Yeah. Amen. The video about Lee Stone King, I have maybe 50 people who have watched that. And when it comes to time, it comes to pass, our website's going to be something like that. Our website. Your testimonies. Amen? We got to start using our testimonies. We're overcomers by the word of our what? Testimony. What? Testimony. What we need to do is, if you would stand up with me. Everybody stand up. Amen. I want everybody to point their hands towards the pastor right now. Everybody. Everybody. I want you to say in Jesus' name. Bring some of that anointing on me. Not just here. Not just there. Everybody say it everywhere. 
Everybody say in Jesus' name. One more time. Jesus' name. Amen.